Hi MFA family, it's Jessica from Minecraft Academy 2. Today I'm going to be making some Earth Day Oobleck. First you're going to need some cornstarch, food coloring, water, a measuring cup, and three bowls. Be sure before you start this activity to have a parent with you as well. The first step is to measure out one cup of cornstarch. So we're going to open our cornstarch, pour it in our measuring cup, and we're going to measure out one cup. It's a little messy. It's a lot messy. I always recommend having a parent helping you because it is pretty messy. Now that we have our one cup, we're almost there. Now that we have our one cup, we're gonna pour it in our bowl. Like I said, it's really messy. And we're gonna measure it out again. This is a little bit too much. We're gonna pour it in this bowl. Now the next step is to clean our measuring cups. I'll be right back once this is clean. Now that our measuring cup is clean, we're going to measure out half a cup of water. Okay, now that we have a half a cup of water, I do recommend putting the food coloring in the water first because it's just a little easier to mix. If we add the food coloring once the oobleck is mixed, it's a little bit harder to get the color. So let's mix this up. And we're gonna slowly pour the water in as we're mixing it. It's gonna be a little bit hard to mix at first and you might have to put in a little bit more water. It just depends on how thick it is. So let's just keep mixing it. Add a little bit more water. You can see it's really hard to mix. This is why we do ask that you have a parent there. Once it's all mixed, it'll be worth it. It's lots of fun to play with. As you can see, I'm struggling a little bit. So I'll be right back once I get this finished mixed. So it was a little hard to mix it with a spoon. So as you can see, I'm mixing it with my hands. And I did need to add a little bit more. So if you see that it's too watery, you can add a little bit more cornstarch. We're finally getting to where it should be. It should look like this to where it's thick, but it also kind of melts in your hand. When you touch it, you see how it's kind of hard. And then when you pick it up, it just melts. So now we're gonna do the same thing with the blue. Now I'm ready to do the same thing with the blue. I did add a little bit more than half a cup of water here because it was, it did need a little bit more and this one has a little bit more cornstarch because I wanted the blue to be more. At the end of this process, what I'm doing is taking the cornstarch and I'm gonna pour it in this bowl and it's gonna look like the earth. So now we're gonna make the blue to represent the water of the earth and the green represented the land. So I'm gonna start mixing it. It was kind of easier when I just poured the whole thing in this time. And I'll be back once the blue is finished. Okay, so now that we have our green and our blue mixed, I want you guys to grab a separate bowl and what we're gonna do is we're gonna pour the oobleck one by one in the bowls. Now, oobleck is considered a non-Newtonium liquid because it is both liquid and solid. It's kind of hard to come out. What I wanna do is mix them in the bowl to make it look like the earth. As you can see, my hands are a bit messy because mixing it did make a big mess, but it still was a lot of fun. 
And as you can see in my hand, it looks hard, but as I let it go, it looks like a liquid. This is what a non-Newtonium liquid means. It's hard, but it's also soft. Now we're done with the blue, we're gonna add in the green. Now I want to add in the green in different spots. So let's see if I can do that. Now it kind of looks like the earth. We made the oobleck today to show you how it kind of represents the soil and the earth. At touch, it's hard. You see I'm hitting with a hammer and it looks really hard. The minute I grab it, it becomes soft again. It's also really pretty to see the colors kind of mixed. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to have a parent present when you do this. And don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Join our MFA family and we'll see you in our next video. Bye.